After eight years of this liberal NDP government, our troops are being forced to use food banks and live in tents. According to the Halifax Emergency Manager, young soldiers are coming to work hungry. The Royal Canadian Legion in Nova Scotia said actively serving members are living rough in tents, living in their vehicles, couch surfing, and even entering into relationships to secure housing that have put them at risk of domestic violence. Why is this Liberal Defence Minister allow this to happen under his watch? Why is he failing our troops? Mr. Speaker, and of course the member opposite is once again badly misinformed. And in fact, when this was reported in the press, the Canadian Armed Forces in Nova Scotia canvassed all of the members of the Armed Forces and determined that all of them were properly housed and that the reporting was false. That's actually not the facts, Mr. Speaker. Nearly 4,500 serving military members are currently awaiting housing, but the Liberals are building less than 20 homes per year for our troops. To add insult to injury, this Liberal Minister just cut a billion dollars from the defence budget, and a leaked report confirmed that the Minister is hiking the rents up for our Armed Forces members. Our military heroes know that these Liberals are just not worth the cost. So why does the Prime Minister always shovel money into the pockets of consultants and Liberal insiders, but cut spending on the backs of our troops. Troops. Good